Okay, so Rufina Finitex, as lots of you know, my main skimming trail. Um, it's pretty clean at the minute, but literally just keep this one for skimming. It's razor, razor sharp. Uh, well broken, you can see it's well broken. Uh, try and keep the back square for cleaning out my angles and stuff. And you'll notice that this one is wrapped up nice and safe. So, just want to show you is, this is next in line. So, like I always say, I always have a new trowel floating, sat in cement, so that I keep a skimming trowel. And uh, it's a backup then, so if anything goes wrong, you still have a trowel. And have this Finitex one. You can see it's, this is grey, it has Refina along the front. Now, where the other one, the older one, seems to be black um, and didn't have the, the brand on the front, but yeah, seems to be pretty much as sturdy and as strong as my favourite one there. And again, this one's breaking in nicely with the sand cement and been doing a lot of floating with this recently, so, and skimming. It's pretty good with the skimming at the minute. And just a quick show you here, this is a brand new one, uh, I've been used once or twice. Um, See the difference of how they break in. Just the corners just wear in a wee bit more. Um, let's, let's show you that one. The front. So it shows you they, they are ready to go but um, to me it just takes a wee bit more breaking in. And again, all when we're on the refiner topic, um have been using this brush. Um, I do like these. I know a lot of people say they're a bit heavy. Um, but let's see what they've sent in this one. Let me click on box them while we're here. So well packed up there. So one of the scent now. So two more skimming brushes here. And slightly different types. Brush hybrid, so feels quite quite similar to the original, um, but maybe a bit more comfortable handle, a bit smaller, smaller handle than the original type. Um, I know these are the one. This is the sort of style that most blasters do have. Um, uh, that lid screws, that handle actually screws off, so you can change handles. It has a hook, so you can hook it on the bucket. That's going to be. Pretty handy actually. Um, so, excellent water retention, waxed hardwood construction for maximum long every day. So, stainless steel, rust free texture. So, hopefully, then, unlike the copper ones, everything's stainless steel and it won't fall apart. Um, I'll just open this smaller one up to give you a deep look. Let's tear that open. I think you're, you probably are supposed to take them like that. So it's plastic in there. It seems like they put a lot of thought into these guys so I imagine this could be a good water brush. This one would be the type I would use for the for cleaning angles and stuff and windows. And then the bigger one would be more for I like the way it screws off. I don't know if that will become a hindrance when it actually when it comes to plastering. Um, so that hook to put on, as you know, when you're flicking, it may come loose, but uh, no doubt after time that'll get covered up with stuff. So yeah, anybody wants to know any more about them brushes, subscribe, and I'll be sure to let you know my thoughts on them.